damn commentary shit. They know the fuck I don't shut up and I say all kind of shit. I'm probably gonna have to edit this shit and be apologizing to people because they you know I say all kind of shit. But this love and hip hop New York with the girl Yandy. That's not right. Let me tell you something. I don't know, I don't know, I, don't, I can't, I can't say, I would really have to dig into it and have my shit together. But from based on what I'm seeing, and what she's saying, girl, come on now. I don't know, again, what the fuck they doing in New York, I'm not from that, I don't know what's going on in New York. You got Mariah's in with all this. <laughs> like, what the fuck is she getting, bitch? And she ain't Bianca, you see all that messy shit right now? If you cool with Bianca, you cool with Bianca, man. Don't nobody do that. If she going to fuck whoever, man, or whatever, bitch, you supposed to be look out by the door and let your girl get her some dick, bitch. What you mean you're going to tell his ass? What kind of haters? What the fuck? All that, uh, what you call that? Meat squad and all what the fuck is going on in New York? Cause them niggas see all that shit and Peter the got going on. Would have jumped on his head. Long time ago. Them bitches wouldn't even got to the point where they all had four babies apiece. Cause one of them would have got with a homegirl. They would have caught that nigga by late night. Got his ass with a bat. Bam. Break him down. He would have knew one motherfucking thing. By the time he would have thought of giving a creep to the next bitch house and get that bitch pregnant again. Bitch, he would have thought about the knees and how he broke his ass down in the knees. And the knees still hurt every time he stroke, he feel a pain in the leg. Ah! Ah! Bet she wouldn't be fucking all the moves in the mud. But, again, like I said, I'm from Louisiana. We just live by our own. It's, it's a whole nother world out there. It's probably why everybody always want to run out there for these vessels and all that shit there. Because you know, I'm not from New Orleans. But I love New Orleans. <laughs> I love New Orleans. Some of the most realest people I've ever met is from New Orleans, man. I'm from a little town outside of New Orleans. You know where I'm not from New Orleans. Because everybody stopped me talking. I love, I love you know. You know, show me so much love and they claim me, baby, and it, it, it's good. But I'm just, I'm not from you know? I love it, you know, but I'm not from you know? So that's that. But back to this Yandy situation. I just don't understand why in her mind it's okay to be like, yeah, I lied and said I was married to that nigga, but I'm not in shit. Wifey, I'm still wifey. God knows I'm wifey. And shit, does it matter what anybody else thinks? God knows I'm the wife. Shit, I'm the wife. What do you know that? You was not nobody wife if you were not legally married to them, Shaq. You just not. I don't care how many rocks, how much you spin, how many videos you make holding up the ring, damn, man. Man, you still not that man wife. And I don't know what's up with these hoes. I saw a video, it was kind of sad because it was funny as hell. One hoe want to attack another hoe because the hoe said pretty much basically the shit I'm saying. Uh, she not his wife. If you bang that hoe in the head, catch that hoe at the cave, or beat her the fuck up, at the end of the day, Andy still not be these fuck. So, why is you so mad? This bitch was really mad. Like, bitch, y'all hoes gonna stop coming for you. Ain't nobody coming for you. You even tell her to say I'm true. She ain't that man. Why is she talking about bitch? I'm pulling boss wife move, bitch. I'm gonna bitch. Girl, you the third baby mama. And the last baby mama. I don't know if she the second or the third baby mama. So y'all can fact check me on that shit. But shit. All the baby mamas is still the same baby mama. And that's that. This shit. God forgive me. Even if she was the wife. If they really was married. The mother girl wasn't showing her no goddamn wifely respect anyway. So, like, she still was yelling, I'm no wife, I'm no wife, I'm no wife. And the girl still was fucking clean over. One got an apartment with the nigga like this. The other one, I don't know, that other girl, the game she played with that day, she can keep. That's her kid. She can keep.
Yeah, she could keep it. Like, I don't know y'all's situation because all I know is what I saw on TV like everybody else. But that kid seemed very happy when he was with his mom and, I mean, his dad and his stepmom might be stepmom, almost stepmom, could be stepmom, future stepmom, one day when he was dealing with his stepmom. I don't know what the title is at this point. They still gotta work that shit out of me and get out of jail by myself. But you can get married in jail because my ex, oh, I tell y'all that story on another video. But the whole he married to that bitch like the communist people. They got married in the prison, so shit, it can be done. But anyway, <laughs> anyway, I don't necessarily like the game she playing with the baby because he old. Like it's not like he's two, three months. This is an old ass kid, and he understands. And whatever went on, who take care of the baby, who had the baby, I don't know. But he was with her, and what he want to like, she want to. I don't know, acknowledge it or not, he was the baby was over there. And they all was with you. Now I'm pretty sure that young man feels somewhere in this car he want to go see his kid be almost possible with his stepmom. Y'all know. I don't necessarily approve of them kind of games. Because I'm like this. Don't play them games with them children from the start. If you don't want your baby to be around no other woman, no stepmom, no none of that shit, well, then cut that shit at the head. Hey, look, dude. No, none of that. Keep my baby away from you. Oh, point blank, period. That way you don't ever start that shit up. But if you allow that shit and you start that shit up, and that baby starts spending time with that lady, that's fucked up to take that baby from that lady and be like, this is my child. Bitch, you ain't about to spend no time. This is my child. This is my child. Now that's, 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 that's kind of, if yeah, she was trash, okay, if she a trashy woman, she didn't just become a trashy woman in 2016. 2017, she's been a trashy woman. If she, all the pictures y'all putting up on the internet, she dirty. Pictures of her house, everything else. Well, if she dirty, she been dirty. So, whatever she been, you can let your child go over there and tell whatever happened and made you feel like your child can't go over there. Everything this woman is, she was when that child was going over Now, she loved the child, no matter what people say about it, you can see when she talk about that little boy. She loved that little boy. And I'm pretty sure that the boy loves her because she loves her. So to keep that baby away from her, even if you go to the park and let that let her meet the baby in the park for an hour. And if you can't stand the whole way, you go play on the other side of the park. Set a timer, 60 minutes with my child, bitch. Let her get her 60 minutes on the swing. And that's, that's just real bitch shit. Like, that ain't, come on, man. That's real bitch shit. Because at the end of the day, that child probably ain't gonna never tell you how he feel about the other woman. Cause if he say something, your ass gonna flip out. And don't nobody, no child wanna hurt their mama. But at the same time, it's like, come on, I feel so sorry for that little boy. But shit, that ain't my business. That's all I got for y'all on these goddamn reality shows.